A successful interactive video conference is not a lecture, it's an interactive lesson. And the format that we work off is a five by five by five one of five minutes of explanation or presentation, five minutes of class activity, and five minutes of students reporting their finished product. If as a presenter you have a question to ask the students, don't ask it as an open question to all the schools. Target a particular school by name. Ask the teacher to nominate a student for their response. Plan for active teacher involvement and make the teacher in the classroom absolutely aware of what their role is going to be. Part of this process is teaching the teacher your strategy so they can replicate that in the classroom. And it is important that the teacher knows their role is going to be an active one. They are not a passive observer. It's important to limit the number of schools in an interactive video conference to four or less. If you're seeking response from the students from one school to another, keep that on a very tight rotation because we found from feedback from the teachers that the students tend to lose focus if they're listening to the other schools for too long. <laughs>